The Gulfport Arts Center receiving a big grant to make some major improvements on their aging building. This money will give them a chance to showcase nationally renowned artists and their work here in South Mississippi. It's a damaged crown jewel of South Mississippi. The old Carnegie Library is one of the coast landmark buildings with so much potential, but it's in need of a facelift. Yeah, the Gulfport Arts Center moved into this building in uh, 2015, but the building itself, this is the Carnegie Library building, it was built over 100 years ago. It's showing its age. In that century, the building has seen its fair number of floods, damage from hurricanes, a problem when it comes to preserving artwork inside. Part, part of being able to protect the art is not to get the things that people think about. I mean, you have to control the humidity inside of a building, but also UV light uh, will actually fade out. If they've seen the, the paint fade, it happens to art too. So we have to uh, UV protect the windows so that, and that's actually a rule to be able to have art exhibits come in from other areas of the country, which we'd love to have for Gulfport. The Art Center is now able to make that happen through a grant from the Mississippi Arts Commission, totaling more than $100,000. That money will help save the building itself, protect the art, and bring in artists from across the country. It's going to be a busy year. For 2024, we're going to get this thing finished, and it's going to be an exciting project. The Gulfport Arts Center is the only nonprofit art studio in the city. The Mississippi Arts Commission awarded $75,000 and the city will award $50,000 towards that renovation project.